watching WSBT Channel 22 News at 6. And new at 6, do you believe in ghosts? Well, there's a group right here in our area that doesn't just believe in them. They hunt for ghosts. WSBT's Annie Chang introduces us to Michiana Paranormal Investigations. Is there anyone in this section of the room that would like to say something? They're Michiana's own Ghostbusters, looking for any evidence that something paranormal is among us. We like to go in and figure out where is this noise coming from? What are the possibilities that might be causing this noise or event to occur? There's something out there that we can't explain. Jeff Price and Liz Brownbridge are the group's lead investigators who also work for the Mishawaka Police Department. They had us meet them at the historic State Theater in downtown South Bend and took us downstairs for our own little ghost hunt. It's the lower basement. Um, this is where uh, a lot of the paranormal activity has been happening. So how do they know there's a ghost nearby? That, especially back here, that definitely is a creepy... Uh... This is creepy. Using these electromagnetic readers, a tool all ghost hunters swear by. If it lights up, they say it's a clue something spooky is going on. This is a prime time to do, like, a question, see if we can get any responses on the K2 meter. As, as far as that goes, we could ask, you know, it, is there anybody down here with us? Nothing yet. Can you light up those lights again for us? Let us know that you're down here. Three lights flash. Okay, thank you. The group is made up of 12 members, several of them police officers. They stayed here all night earlier this week, and some pretty eerie things happened. At one point, radio frequency turns on for no reason. What is it? Are you having anything to do with the radio going off? And then in the basement, exactly where we were, look closely. A light falls off the railing with no one around. But does that really mean ghosts exist? I don't say I necessarily believe in ghosts. I've never really personally seen one in my life. But I've been in a lot of situations where we've had things happen that we cannot explain. And every sort of rationale that we put out there doesn't make sense for what we're experiencing. It's at least worth investigating. Just the love for, for ghost hunting. In South Bend, I'm Annie Chang, WSPT Channel 22 News. Wow, Annie got a up close look. Did you see her face? The, the look on her face when those lights lit up. Yeah, she's like, ooh, there's a ghost in here. Wow. Just in time for Halloween, that's I know. for sure.